Hi everybody, it's me again uh, with a little time out for me and I am bringing, guess what, another Timu haul. This one looks like it's, the package is about twice as big as my last one. Again, I do not remember what I ordered. Um, <laughs> it's, um, like I said before, it's been a rough couple weeks, bought this before all this craziness happened and can't quite remember what I ordered, but I will for sure. Um, anything as of this recording that's still available, I will go back in and put links in the description. So if you want them, you can get it yourself too. But this is going to be a big one. So grab a drink and let's get to it. So let's see. Um, while I open up the package, just let you know. Um, welcome if you're new. This is my channel, A Little Time Out for Me. Wanted to focus on self-care the past couple years, so I thought I would, um, not only for myself, but to help hopefully inspire others to take a little time out for yourself too. I love to do Timu hauls, Dollar Tree hauls, unboxing of different subscription boxes, um, crafts. I love to make crafts. I hope to share a craft here soon with you. I've been promising that and haven't been able to craft myself, but hopefully I'm going to get to a point where I can do some things and um, use up some of the stuff that I've been buying for sure. I do got I do need to start a craft my stash um, series too because I have a lot, a lot of crafts and I really want to start using them up. Okay, well here we go and oh my golly, some of this looks like duplicates of things that I bought in the last set. Um, I will post my last video. I already shared these, so I'm not gonna open these ones up again, but these beautiful sunflower stickers, different patios with sunflowers are amazing. If you wanna see the whole collection, I think there's 10 in here, two of each. There's five prints, two of each, so 10 total. Um, I will put a link in here to that last video that I did with my craft, my last craft Timu haul, and you can see the prints in that video, but it looks like I got some duplicates in this. I must have double clicked. That's some, well, I don't know what I did. Actually, do not know what I did. <laughs> Just here's another duplicate. This is also in my last video. I got um, more washi tape with yellow flowers, sunflowers and daffodils and bees. This one's a little bit more beat up. Um, definitely can use this box in junk journaling. Um, if you want to see what's in here, also watch that last video I made. You'll see the different prints in there. Or if you've seen that video, then you know what's in there. Hopefully those are the only two duplicates I have in here. Okay, so here is, oh, here's to hold all my cute little thing, bibbity bobs that I've been getting. Like my formal term, bibbity bobs. Okay, this is an organizing case. So here's the case. It's got a little handle. Again, I will put, if it's available, I will, at the time of this recording, I will put the link below. But it's a little case that holds littler cases. So I figured this would be perfect to hold littler stickers, um, pieces that I cut out for collaging since I'm starting to do that. I've been doing that lately. It's been keeping my mind busy and it's nice, fast, and easy. Um, beads, threads. Um, little embellishment charms for junk journals. Oh, look at all this. There's there's a lot of little boxes in here. Let me just do some multiplication here. So there's one, two, three, four. Four down. Um, and four across. So 16 and 16. Wow, 32 little boxes in here. That is a lot. Um, that is a really good deal. I seriously don't think I paid that much for this. So hopefully this is still available so you can check it out. It's a, look at how nice. It's just a little case you can carry around. I am really impressed with this. Love it. Okay, whoops. Didn't mean to shake everyone there. Um, that is very cool. Oh yay, I do remember getting this. This is, I have to do my pen collection too. I love collecting pens. I am a pen addict, I do admit that. And this is a color pencil and marker pen case. I have another one, which is right next to me here, so I'll show you that. But um, 
The other one I have is in pink. Let's see if I can pull it out without causing major disruption here next to me. But it's, it's just like this one that I have here. This one is completely stuffed and I have tons more pens. It has a handle so you can carry it. But I wanted a different one similar in the same color or a different color, similar style. And there's three different pockets on it. This one, this one has four. No, this has four different sections as well. But I'll open the other sections for you. I just think it's a great way because you can just stick all your pens and pencils in here like this. I'll show you. I'll give you a little peek of this pink one. See, I have all different kinds of markers and Sharpies and pens and pencils. So it, um, can you see all that? Yep, you can. Okay. So it does hold a lot. And I have them by different types. So I needed, I have a lot of pens. <laughs> so that's what that one's for. It's to start filling up another one. So yay, but I got that. Um, Here's some more adhesive tape. I think this is the kind that the kind that is resealable. You can wash it and reuse it. Um, there's a name brand called Alien Tape. I don't know what this one is, um, but I think this is the same stuff. It's, it's repositionable tape. You can use it over and over again you just rinse it off and it gets sticky again and you can use things to hang like lighter weight items on the wall like the dollar tree signs um little little things little lights and things like that it's nothing that's too heavy um i actually use it um at my desk and i put my my cell phone stick it to the side and then just twist it and pop it off again and i use it so that i love that tape that tape's awesome so, stickers. There's a lot of stickers in here. Oh, before we go on to the stickers, here is, yeah, somehow I redid it again. This is in my last haul too. Looks like I got a duplicate. Um, may have to start doing some giveaways if I've had lots of duplicates. So, if you want to know what all the prints are in here, please check out my last video. Again, I'll have it linked here so you can get to it easily but you can see all the prints in there from that video i'm not going to go through it again with this one okay wow this is a lot of stuff for you guys you guys have a snack doing okay have a snack um i know we're only about eight minutes in here this is a cute cute bunting like a banner uh how can i open it where here we go Sometimes it's so hard to see where the flap is on these things. There's some crinkly ASMR for you too. <laughs> for those that enjoy that. Um, oh my gosh. I'm not going to open this all the way out. I'll try to find the photo of it so that you can see it. Or actually, again, if it's available, it'll be linked in the description. But it's a little banner. Um... This will be cute for spring and Valentine's Day. Look at all the different prints. I will show you all the different prints without opening it up and messing up the way it's set up. Well, that's the back side. But look at that. How pretty is that? Maybe put some roses with it, some silk roses kind of inter intertwined within the banner. Some other little ribbon in between. That'll be really pretty. Although I need to hurry because it is almost Valentine's Day and we don't have anything up yet. But this will be pretty for spring too. Or a little girl's birthday party or a tea party. This is just, it can be used for a lot of different things. Very pretty prints in here. Really like it. They're all um, cut with pinking shears so they shouldn't fray. Very nice. Nice seam binding that they're all attached to. Very pretty. Look at all that. Wow. You can see all the binding and how they're stitched. They all seem to be stitched really well to the binding. The 
seam ribbon, so very nice, very pretty. I do not remember ordering that. Like I said, it was going to be a surprise. Okay, now it looks like uh, there are a ton of stickers. Oh, here's some paper. I do definitely have a theme going here, don't I? Pink and roses, pink and roses. I do love pink. My nails show you that. I love pink. Um, I think by the time this video comes out, you might even be able to see how I um, joined me in the manicure for this. Um, it was a self-care Sunday. I can put the link to that below as well. Um, but this is one of my other favorite timeouts for me is to give myself a manicure. And this was done with Color Street. So if you'd like to know about that, I will link that video as well. Right, let's look at these papers. So Garden of Dreams, six by six paper pad, 12 different designs, two sheets each. Heavyweight cardstock. Let's see how heavyweight is it. This first one, this first label is pretty heavy. Oh, it's a good size. This is this is definitely thicker. You could definitely use this in your journaling to, in your crafts as well. It's a good, decent paper. Not a heavy cardstock type. Um, it says it's 160 GSM and it's acid and lignin free. But it's it's a good it's one sided and it's a good weight. It's not hard. It's still a paper weight. Um, but I like it. Look how pretty. These would go so pretty with those stickers I hauled in my last haul. Again, really do need to check out that haul. There were some really cool stickers. I was an ephemera kit in there. Um, watch that. That would go well with this. Definitely would go well with these papers. It's one cute one for Valentine's Day. More ribbon. More bows with a rose. Rose with a rose. Yeah, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just getting loopy now. <laughs> I'm just having fun going through my Timu haul. Sharing it with everybody. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this stuff. Sometimes do you think you're more of a collector of crafts than actually a crafter? Let me know if that's you. Sometimes I think that's me. I do want to craft. I do love to craft, but sometimes there's, especially when you have younger kids, there's just no time. Now my kids are getting a little older, so I'm getting a little bit more time back for myself, but you know how it goes. If you know, you know. So that is the pretty pack of papers. I am happy I have that. It makes me happy. Okay, let's dig into some of these. There's oh, some more of that tape. I must have gotten two rolls because I really need it. Don't remember what I needed it for, but I need it. Okay, look at there's just a bunch of little packs of stickers. So I will see this one. I seriously think I might have duplicated. Hopefully, I didn't duplicate everything in that last haul, but these stickers. Are in that other video? Go check out that video. We won't have to go through those now. These other ones are new ones, so let's check them out. I'm gonna do them. They're the smaller pack, so hopefully these won't go long. Might have to break this into a two-parter. We shall see. Do you like seeing the stickers? I think you like seeing stickers. I know I do when I watch people. I love seeing the stickers. This has been this is gonna be new for me. I've been watching blue books and, and journaling where people use the paper dolls. Hadn't been into it yet, but I'm kind of liking it. So I wanted to give it a try. So I did buy some different stickers with the cute um the pretty paper dolls. So doll um to add into like the theme of your page or your spread. So I'm gonna, these are contemporary, and this is coffee. Goes with my coffee theme. I am thinking of making a coffee book. Yes, I am. So these all go with that. So pretty. I just, I don't know who the artist is on these, but they are just beautiful. Beautiful pieces. I just, and they're stickers. I mean, so cute. So cute. So that's that set. Again, there are more sets of these little stickers. 
in that last haul too so definitely check that out if you have not checked it out already looks like there's some more coffee i think i got every style of coffee in that you know how they have different types in one one um catalog item there's different styles i think i got all the styles of the coffee yes i did and i'm not ashamed <laughs> a cute little bow in it kind of thing i want to do something a galentine's day thing for my gal pals that really have helped me through the last couple few last few weeks they are just they're like my sisters and really been supportive um I mentioned in a previous video, my mom passed away recently. She was like my best friend. Um, been always there for me and trying to cope with that has been rough. And they were definitely there. So I kind of want to do a Valentine's Day project for them and go take it to them on the, thir on the 13th. So hopefully I can get me to do that and I will share with you what I did might not be until I give it to them so I don't want the surprise but <laughs> that was that coffee set here is another coffee set oh are you a coffee person if you're not I do apologize because there's a lot of coffee here isn't there and if you are a coffee person how do you like your coffee if you're not a coffee person, what do you like to drink? Do you drink tea, soda, water, some other special kind of, I don't know, like bubbly or something like that? Let me know. I'm trying to be better about drinking more water, drinking flavored waters, but I don't know. These coffee house ones are just so pretty. I just could not resist and I could not decide, so I got them all. these hopefully will fit in my little maybe they won't i might need bigger containers for these i might have to put beads in that little container with all the little pink square containers in it in that box but tea sets too i've been into tea sets too i do like tea as well so here you go to all my tea drinkers out there beautiful little teapots i do like myself a good cup of tea as well mostly at night to relax um, you like, and I do like iced tea as well. That's pretty. Cute, 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 cute. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. You should make a tea party book. That would be fun, a tea party book. And do all different kinds of cute things with some of these stickers that are, and papers that go with tea party. And then maybe add some recipes for different like tea party things. Oh, that might be fun. Okay, don't worry, there's more stickers. Oh, and there's more of this repositionable. It keeps us three rolls. I'm going to find out how many rolls I have all together. But there is a ton. Look, look at all the stickers. Stickers, stickers, stickers. How are we doing on time? And there's more coffee in here. So, this one, ooh, this is one of those big packs. I'll see that one later. If you saw that last video, you'll know what I'm talking about. Those big ephemera packs have so many goodies in them. They're so cool. This is butterflies and coffee. This must be part of that coffee series of them. But now you got the cute little pretty butterflies and flowers. And they're all different. I mean, I mean they kind of look like the same pattern, but they're different colors, so... I kind of really hope I'm holding this high enough so you can see them. There, that's better. So pretty. These, I just cannot get over these. Ooh. I like the different colors. This is adding little teals and oranges and purples, blues. Very pretty. These at least these packs go fast, huh? And again, if they are available at the, at, as of the time I'm recording this, I will link them below. Oh, this will go with my sewing ones. 
I don't remember if the slime ones were in this video or my last video. But these are part of that series. There was a bunch in that too, and I couldn't decide, so I got a bunch. Um, I love this one. I just thought these wardrobe ones are so cute. They're just so cute. Oh, I do want to do a craft book too. So that's where some of this is coming in, craft or sewing and sewing. Mm, it's so cute. So pretty. There's another seamstress. Another pretty dress. I would love, I love dresses. They're so pretty. I just don't ever go anywhere for dresses. I love to dress up, but working from home and even going to work I wouldn't dress up like that <laughs> they're so look at how pretty these dresses are love it I love these images they're so pretty how oh, pretty 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 so let's like see how many times I say pretty <laughs> More threads and roses. That, the colors, the colors are just, I love the colors. The, the combinations, oh, look at that. The ribbons and then this one, look at that. So cute and so pretty. Love it. Oh, stickers, stickers, so many stickers. This may be a two-parter, folks. This may be a two-parter. These look like, let's see, what series did this one come from? Looks like it might have been another coffee series. Oh, and I dropped one. Missed it. Oh, bunch of cups. Cute. This would be fun to get, like, vintage teacups and put flowers on them. I love this place. Donut. Yum. I'm hungry. <laughs> These are not helping. Very cute. Oh, look at that cute little cupcake. It's just so pretty. This must be mint chip. That reminds me of mint chocolate chip. Coffee and donuts. Coffee and donuts. Oh, that might be a fun little Galentine gift to do. Make some cute little card with these and then take a coffee and donut to my friends. That would be fun. Now this one. Let's see, I'll probably do these and then I will stop and do another part two. Let's get through these four packs and then call it on this video. Tea party. Definitely tea party. Oh, pretty. Look at that. That is just very pretty. Can you see that? Yep. Hey, look. It matches my little bunting, my little banners. See? That little banner would come in so cute for a tea party just like this. I'll bring it to life. Pretty. Another. Oh, pretty. Must be wind outside. I can hear our wind chimes going. It sounds very relaxing. I just looks up when my dog starts making his noises. <laughs> Another tea party dress. Oh, I wish I had that dress. Don't know where I'd wear it, but I wish I had it. It's very pretty. Love the stickers. Do not know why. I am sorry. I am getting a little loopy. Maybe it's because I need to eat. <laughs> so I'll do after we look at these stickers. I'm going to take a break and have lunch. And then I'll keep on sharing what I got in this haul that I don't remember ordering. That's 
it's just been so crazy. I can't even tell you how crazy it's been. Okay. Ooh. Berries. Must be from the tea party set yet again. I really think these were, they had to have been under $2. Because I wouldn't spend more than that. I wouldn't even spend that, actually. But I love these images so much. Mm. I had to get them. Oh my gosh, I apologize for my dog again. It's probably uh, and, uh, 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 making all those kind of funky noises. And you can hear them. Then watch, I'm making the noises and you can't hear them. You're going to think I'm crazy. I'm not. Just having fun. Enjoying my little time out. Sharing all this stuff with you. And then thinking about how I'm going to use them. Oh, they're so pretty. I just love these stickers. What would you do with these stickers? Would you even like these stickers? Do you like these stickers? Okay, this kind of looks like another one. But it doesn't look exactly like it, so I'm going to pull it out. There's another banner. Flag banner. Yeah, these are different, I think. Ooh, that would be pretty in my perfume journal. I need to show you my perfume journal and what it's all about. Okay, that looks like an eyeball to me. I don't know why. Does it look like an eyeball to you? It looks like an eyeball to me. I know it's not, but anyway. <laughs> Another beautiful dress. So pretty. Oh, look at this little guy. Oh, cute. That is so cute. Okay. Oh, another cutie. Pretty, pretty. I just, I just got the paper doll stickers. I'm not exactly sure what they're called, but I've heard people call them paper dolls. Um, but these ones in this, this collection was, were just so pretty, I thought I would give it a try. in my book. Okay, last one for this half of the haul, and I will make a part two for another day. Let's get through these. These look like craft and sewing ones from that series. Oh, kind of looks like my mama. Hi, mom. Love you, mama. Again, remembering my mom and how she would sew. She passed away recently. That's why it's been a little crazy. Oh, these are all pretty. Oh, I like the thread. Isn't that pretty? Oops. There we go. That's better. These two are very cool. With all the different things in the cabinets. Nice, nice stickers. Don't know what else to say. Like the dress forms too with the flowers. Very pretty. Oh, these ones are my favorites with the, the older women sewing. Reminds me of my mama. Cute. Okay, well, that is the first half of this haul. Again, um, thanks for sticking out with me. Good. Another little half hour. Taking a little time out for you while I take a little time out for me. Um, check out the last video for some of these things that I didn't show all the pieces to because they're in that video. Thank you again for sticking with me through this. Also, like and subscribe and be ready to see the second half of this haul coming up in the next video. And thank you again for spending time with me. I really appreciate it. Um, the likes and subscribes and the comments really help my channel to grow. And I really do appreciate it. This is um, kind of my self-care for me. And I hope that it helps inspire you for self-care too and think of different ways to give yourself a little time out in the day. So take care. See you later.